Hello my students, how are you? Let's get started. Today's lesson is grammar. Unit 14. Grammar unit 14. Okay, let's get started. Okay, Moby is saying here, what do you remember about the Romans? What do you remember about uh, the Romans? Do you remember the Romans? Our last reading session, we were talking about the Romans. Okay, who are the Romans? The Romans are the people who lived in Rome in the past. Okay. Okay, so let's read what's in the box. How many people like to watch chariot races? How many people like to watch chariot races? Lots of people or a lot of people? How much time did they spend at the stadium? How much time did they spend at the stadium? Lots of time, a lot of time. Let's see the first question and the first answer. How many? How many? You know this question. We use how many to ask about the number. To ask about the number. How many people? How many people like to watch chariot races? You want to know about a number. Okay? So the answer is lots of people. Lots of people means a lot of people. Okay? Many, many people or a lot of people so lots of or a lot of the same meaning lots of something or a lot of something the same meaning they have the same meaning okay how much how much did they spend at the stadium here we want to know about the number two but there is a difference of course, between how many and how much. There is a difference between how many and how much. What is the difference between them? How many? After how many? The noun after how many must be countable and plural. Countable and plural. How many people like to watch chariot races? People here is... A noun and it's plural plural noun not singular okay so how many people so because we, we are asking about people and the word people is plural and countable we can count people so we used how many what about how much the word or the noun after how much it must be uncountable or singular okay how much time time we can't count time we don't we don't have uh, a word called times no time how much time did they spend at the stadium how much water for example uh, did uh, he drink okay so if we have that the, the the noun that we are asking about is um, singular or uncountable we use how much we use how much okay and the answer lots of and a lot of the same meaning let's see some examples some more examples okay we have here how much uh, sorry the word much and many Let's see much on left here. Much is used with uncountable nouns. Uncountable nouns. Okay? Mainly for uncountable nouns. Okay? Let's see the examples. How much money? How much money have you got? Money is uncountable. We don't have we don't have a word called the monies 
so it's uncountable now we didn't spend much money we didn't spend much money much may come uh, in negative statements there isn't much data to download there isn't much data to download the word data uh, data means the thing that you have in your laptop for example or your computer or mobile phone it, it means or it called the data or data there isn't much data to download so data is uncountable I'm sorry but I don't have much time time don't say many time much time too much water water it's uncountable drawn the mirror water here uncountable so we used much what about mini mini is used with countable nouns countable plural nouns it come question affirmative negative I don't have many friends I don't have many friends it must be friends I don't have many friends there are too many disadvantages in this business disadvantages it's a, um, it's a plural noun or countable noun how many children children plural how many children do you have how many children do you have children is plural the plural of child are there many poor people in France are there many poor people people count and a plural in France so we use many here okay so it's so simple okay these are some more examples about how many and how much let's see how many how many animals are there animals how many balls can you carry plural how many plates of grass are there plates plural how many cars how many children how many colors how many eggs how many fish can you see swimming how many games fish here countable and uncountable you can say one fish and two fish okay how many games shall we play games how many grains like seeds the seed of the plant um, but grain means a small thing a very small thing how many pieces of cake did you eat how many pieces how many planks or planks of wood plank means a piece of wood a big piece of wood how many toys do you have how many toys plural that's what that was about how many uh, what about how much how much cheese is left how much effort how much farther to walk how much homework how much milk how much noise how much rope do I need how much sand is on the beach sand how much soup how much stuff is in my room how much time how much traffic traffic is there how much water should I drink all of these uncountable or singular nouns singular or uncountable nouns okay how much time did the teacher ask how much homework how much homework was finished okay so it's so simple so simple please study these uh, questions and try to make some more questions in your own uh, to practice okay now this is the language book open the language book please this is unit uh, for uh, 14 grammar okay uh, the first bubble here is asking about soldiers 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 are plural so we use how many or how much how many how many soldiers are there 
So the answer is lots of soldiers or a lot of soldiers. Okay, if you want to ask about money, money is uncountable. How much money? We don't use how many or we don't say how many money. How much money is there because it's uncountable. Don't, we don't have a word called money. How much money is there? Lots of money or a lot of money. So here we have one, two, three, four. Look at the picture first. Decide uh, which kind of nouns. Is it plural or singular noun? And use how many or how much. Make a question and the answer. Now stop the video and try to answer it. Replay the video after you finish the answering and check your answers with me. Okay, the first uh, picture, we are asking about stones. So it's how many, really good. How many stones? How many stones are there? There are lots of stones. There are lots of stones. Okay, number two, we have fruit. Fruit. Hmm? How much fruit is there? How much fruit is there? There is lots of fruit. There is lots of fruit. How many roads are there? How many roads are roads are there? There are a lot of roads. There are a lot of roads because it's plural. Mud. Mud is hmm, yes, singular or uncountable. How much mud is there? How much mud is there? There is much mud. There is much mud. The next question. We're asking about in the bubble here. Chariots and water. Chariots and water. How many chariots are there? There are just two. So there are not many. There are not many. We have how many? If they are not many, the answer is not many. They are not many. They are not many. Many, or there are not many. How much water is there in the glass here? We have hmm, little, little water. So say no, not much. How much water is there? Uh, there is no, not much. You can answer not much. Okay. So we have feathers, we have bread, we have snow, we have helmet, and answer like. Like the examples here, huh? not many feathers, not much bread, etc. So number one, make a question about the feathers. How many feathers are there? Not many, because we ask it about how many. So the answer is, it must have the word many. If they are not many, okay. Two. Bread. How much bread is there? Not much. Yes, that's right. Very good. Number three. Snow. How much snow is there? Not much. We have much in the question, much in the answer. Helmets. Yes, helmets, plural. How many helmets are there? Not many. Not many. Okay. This is the last question, I think, in the language book. Say it in right. People food we have people and food make sentence like you see here the first sentence there are lots of people but there isn't much food so the first word we use with lots of we in sentence and we add but then we put food for negative isn't much food okay People are plural, so we said there are lots of people. There are lots of people, because it's plural. Food is huh, uncountable, so there isn't much food. There isn't much food. Okay, we have rivers and bridges. Rivers and bridges. There are lots of rivers. There are lots of rivers rivers are plural so we used the word are there are lots of rivers but there aren't many bridges 
there aren't many bridges okay bridges are plural so we, uh, we use are and for negative aren't number one children and books children plural books plural so we have there are here and there aren't here so there are lots of children but there aren't many books number two fruit hmm. uncountable and vegetables countable very good so there is or there are there are lots of vegetables it's okay but there isn't much fruit okay number three bread and butter both of them are uncountable there is lots of bread but there isn't much butter number four we have biscuits plural juice uncountable there are lots of biscuits but there isn't much juice biscuits okay now this uh, the language the booklet let's answer the booklet Uh, number one, how many or much or few coffee did you drink? Coffee, uncountable, much. There are a lot of pencils, but there is not much. There is, we have is here, so it must be singular. We have paper, books, rulers. Paper, yes, that's right, because it's singular. How many girls are there? Huh? How many girls are there? Lots of girls, not many, not much. Let's continue the sentence. There are only two girls. So they are not much or not many? Not many. Yes, that's right. For how many soldiers or soldiers or a soldier are there? Soldiers. Well, it must be plural. How many or more or much lemonade do you want? There aren't, huh? Or the, no. How many more or much lemonade do you want? Let's answer this first. Lemonade. It's huh? uncountable. So it must be much. Number six. There aren't, aren't, or aren't much or a lot of or many children in the playground. There aren't many children in the playground. Very good. There isn't many or much or a lot of bread in my house. There isn't. We have bread, so it must be much bread. Next question in the booklet. There are lots of people. Ask with how. People. How many people are there? Two, ask about how the answer is there isn't much food there isn't much food is in food so how much food is there now we will answer how many bridges are there how many bridges are there answer it how many bridges are there or so there are lots of bridges how much juice is there how much juice is there answer we have juice we have is so there is huh, a lot of juice okay we can we can answer not much it's the same but here we will use not I ate, number five, I ate a lot of food. I ate a lot of food. Negative. I ate a lot of food. Make it negative. How do you, how to put not here? Yes, I didn't eat much food. I didn't eat much food. I read a lot of books. I read a lot of books. So make it past. I didn't read many books. 
explain to read many books. We add many here because books uh, are the word books is singular. There is a lot of juice in the fridge. Make it negative. There, huh? there isn't much juice. Juice is uncountable, so much. The last one, there are a lot of cars, plural, countable, so we will use many. There aren't many cars in our street. That's right. That's it. Thank you for watching. See you next session, inshallah.